Well, welcome to Montenegro. Uh, we came through an awful train ride from Serbia last night. Took the, oh, the whole day yesterday. It was awful, but uh, to wake up uh, this morning in uh, Mojkovic and uh, ride out into this Tara River Canyon. Um, so spectacular. It's just uh, really, really beautiful. So what a morning cycling it's been. Definitely uh, roads very quiet, but really good condition. Uh, really, really happy so far. And uh, yeah, got a big day ahead of us, big climbing and everything like that. But um, I think uh, definitely uh, looking forward to uh, what Montenegro has to offer us now. So all good. Gotta love it. <laughs> Well, what a morning it's been. The canyon walls have just grown and grown and bigger and bigger. The hills around us have just got so jagged and just spectacular. And uh, wow, just uh, really friendly people. It's just been so nice riding through it. And uh, finally we end up here, uh, down by the river for our lunch spot. The river's looking beautiful and blue there. So uh, nice bite of lunch to be had rewarding us for this morning's minimal effort. Well, after cycling all morning up through this valley, we've come to the Grand Bridge. It's been pretty hard the entire morning to wipe the smile off my face, uh, but this bridge marks the point where we turn. We head way up there somewhere. It's a 700 odd metre climb, and I suspect that might wipe the smile off my face for a bit, but uh, we'll enjoy it for just a bit longer. <laughs> Well, it appears we're at the top, and I'm still smiling, so uh, I think I must have got a lot more fit since those days back in Italy. Uh, it was a pretty decent hill climb up there, about 10, 11 k's worth of uh, straight up, but mercifully it wasn't too steep, and uh, I think we've, uh, we've managed pretty well. So now it's just straight on to Zabuljak, which is uh, somewhere up there in the future. So. All the hard work for the day, I think, is uh, is mostly done, and uh, wasn't really that bad. I think. Well, day two of Montenegro, starting out from Zabljak. We're heading down this way, and somewhere up over there's a huge mountain range that sort of carries on behind this one, which is where we're heading today. Up and over, should be fun. Well, we've come from down there, way down there in the valley. It's been an easy ride up so far. And just as we've been coming up the mountain, the scenery's just been getting better and better as we've come up. Uh, it's very different riding from yesterday. Yesterday we were in the closed in canyon walls all around us, but uh, here today we're sort of right out in the open. We've got the, the wide mountain views all around us as we've been coming up. Um, we're just starting to get above the tree line here, the sort of shrubs and, and things, the trees are really getting small, the tiny little trees and up above we start to see all the just the bare rocks and, and the bare mountains up above. So uh, yeah, really, really beautiful stuff and uh, lots to enjoy here. Remember, no pain, no gain folks. <sighs> It's funny, these cars coming up these roads, I think there's people in them looking at us going, geez, you'd have to be mad to cycle up this thing, but uh, I think the views that we're getting and the way that you can enjoy it on the bikes, I think Fiona and I are thinking you'd be mad to do it any other way. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Less enthusiastic. Well, here we are at the lunch stop. Hooray! We've made it to the top. So I think here we're about 2100 metres coming up and over the pass here and uh, off down the other side down here. Uh, so this is our road for this afternoon. We go down into this valley here and uh, then pretty much just straight up the other side. So uh, a bit of up and down again. We had lunch up at the top of the hill and I was like getting all my gear together and everything like that and put all my, my stuff on the back here and left my gloves on there and rode off. We got to the bottom of the hill, I'm like shit, one of the gloves was sitting on there and the other one wasn't. And 
Just then, a guy drove past in a car and said, beep, beep, stop, just up the hill here. He goes, hey, is this your glove? <laughs> oh, yeah, awesome. <laughs> That's like 30 euros worth of gloves there, so. Uh, yeah, and what about the other pair of gloves you've already lost? <laughs> yeah, well, let's not worry about them, but Montenegrin people so far are so amazingly friendly. Just up the top of the hill here, we were forced, well, I was forced to have like a whole pint of beer and shots of bloody schnapps, schnapps and stuff, uh, so. And I've got a, 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 a penny a full of eggs and chicken and bread and what else? Yeah, so, <laughs> wow, man, it's like, it can't get much better today, so, uh, yeah, it's all just working out so well. <laughs> And of course, we hadn't quite had enough uh, nice scenery for the day, so uh, I figured we had to top it off with this amazing gorge and ravine down here. So, uh, yeah, it does make for uh, pretty nice days to uh, finish uh, riding down to the bottom. And hopefully, the gods are with us, we'll find a room down there somewhere. Well, it's day three of Montenegro and uh, we spent about the first hour thus far this morning climbing from way down there, way up here. So yet another massive hill climb. Uh, still got a bit more to go heading up this way to the pass. Uh, yeah, hell of a lot of mountains in this country, but I guess what else do you expect from uh, a place whose name Montenegro literally means Black Mountain? Well, it's been a beautiful afternoon's downhill run after the hard work this morning and uh, Still got a fair bit of downhill to go. Way down there is the town of Nixik, where we will be ending our ride today. So, not a bad morning's ride. A lot of uphill, but uh, nice to be going down. And for something totally different, we've uh, ended up uh, in the very cosmopolitan uh, uh, happening uh, street life here of uh, Nixik. So uh, we have a have a night uh, away from the mountains and the hills and uh, a bit of civilization. So, cheers.